walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. Right then. Obviously, the main present I got this year for Christmas was Gran Turismo, but I did get a couple of other games, and this was one of them. Batman Returns on the Mega CD. Uh, I'm not sure whether this starts in the racing mode or the platform mode. I haven't actually tried the platform mode yet. I had a go, <coughs> had a go at the racing thing yesterday. I love this. Just the enormous sprites that it throws around. I mean, wow. That's huge. <coughs> really shows what the Mega CD can do in terms of throwing sprites around. Uh, I believe if this is the platform mode, this is pretty much just what you would get on the Mega Drive. At the mo no, no, we're we're. I'm probably have to going to go through the modes just to uh, get to the um, the platform game section because so far all I've seen is this, um, which in my opinion is no bad thing because I love this. It's uh, again, ma massive great big sprites that it hurls around. I mean these buildings by the time you get near to them. They're enormous, and the Mega Drive on its own just could not do that. In terms of gameplay, this is uh, quite difficult. I get hammered. Badly. And indeed, most of the time I don't even get off this level. So, uh, you know. We'll just see how it goes. This is using that horrendous up to accelerate control. Uh, it's, it's not too bad, it's not hampering me too much. I've used up all my missiles, I've used up all, oh I've got some more boost. But I'm not going to get very far. Oh crap. Yay, Christmas tree. Not very festive looking. Did I say? Yes. Not very festive looking Christmas tree. It must be said. Very dark and kind of moody. Yeah. There are some power-ups, sort of pick-up things that you come across here. And I just, I always miss them. Oh, that got him. Oops. These guys seem to lob, I don't know, petrol bombs or something, and I cannot see them until I've hit them, which is a bit of a shame. There, those, there. See, missed them, power-ups, but they're so fleeting. Time's up. Dull. I have reached the end of this level and come across some like a uh, dust cart with a giant jack-in-a-box thing that flies out of it, which was novel. I've only reached that once. don't know what it was. I think they're like time bonus or extra missiles or something. Or extra boost, energy boost, flame, the turbo boostish thing. That. I can't string a sentence together. I'm still a little bit hungover. <laughs> um, yeah, I got somewhat mullered last night. Happy New Year, by the way, if I haven't said it already. I think it is such a crying shame that the Mega CD wasn't more successful because it is, when they use the hardware, it is so vastly superior 
to what they do on the Mega Drive or what the Mega Drive can do. Um, I I really like sprites. You know, good sprite scaling, huge sprites, throwing lots of them around. I really really like. And well, this just does it really well. It's such a shame it didn't do better. Um, I don't know. I don't know where the reason lies for that. Was it Sega not promoting it properly? Was it because it was too expensive? Was it that the third party developers didn't want to know? Um, I think it's a terrible shame. And a wasted opportunity. Because it, when it's used like this, it's fantastic. Okay, I'm going to pause here and reset and um, <coughs> have a look at the platform game. Okay then, I've never played this before, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh dear. It's big. That's a big sprite. Mind you, I've got it all stretched out on this uh, screen. What's going on? I have no idea. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh! It's a bit harsh. I would have thought I could... Hello. Okay. Bugger off. Oh, that's just like Spider-Man, isn't it? Huh. Almost. Oh! What are these things? It's like he's walking around picking up CDs or something. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, alright. I don't know what's happening. Um, I can't really say that's doing it for me. Obviously I don't know what I'm doing. I probably ought to read the instructions. But at the end of the day, I'm not a fan of platform games. And that one is like, yeah, yeah, whatever. I've got something similar for that on the snares. So I'll have to have a look at that and see how it compares. Though I believe that one is probably not great either. But the racing game on here is fantastic and worth buying the game for alone. As you don't have to do the platform thing to do the driving thing. And that's a very good move on Sega's part. Okay, uh, so, Batman Returns, Sega Mega CD. Half of it's great, half of it isn't. Hmm, thank you for watching.